this one year, and I've got a feeling you said it was 14 then, so it must be a long one. That's how old I was when we started. Anyway, he's here to entertain us again tonight, as well as test our minds and brains. Um, it's difficult to say exactly these days um, how many claims there are on us for international relief in some shape or form, because as everybody's aware, we've had such a lot of natural disasters in the last two or three years that um, we have to be ready for the next one. Now, thank you very much for the participation. I hope you have a super evening. No. Never worked with children, animals, or any. It's very difficult to follow. Thank you. Right, good evening. Uh, this must be Lane in London. Uh, uh, might be a trick question. <laughs> Number two. Number two. Perry Mason. <laughs> yeah, we won't accept that, I'm afraid. That woman. And the next one, which is number seven, which famous building with an equally famous black door has a letterbox engraved with the words First Lord of the Treasury? <coughs> which famous building with an equally famous black door has a letterbox engraved with the words First Lord of the Treasury. I'll, um, I'll just repeat that. Listen carefully. <laughs> Oswald Copperpot is an evil avian character. Avian. Whatever you say. <laughs> Sad. Yes, sadly, that doesn't apply. That one doesn't. She's not listening. Seventy three, seven three, yellow, yellow, seventy three.
No, 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 no. <laughs> the, uh, right, the answers to the last round. And then we'll give you the total now. I'd like to come out to table four. You don't have to if you've used up all your energy on the answers. Right. Uh, yeah, I mean, I'll give you that to We're just not going to tell her where the energy is quizzing. <laughs> right, thank you very much. I hope you had an enjoyable time. I know some of the questions were testing, but it wouldn't be a quiz without testing questions. Uh, perhaps I'll see you again. The president's going to make some or something. The president's going to say a few words. Whether he, whether he wants to or not. Well, at least we didn't come last. <laughs> um, I'd like to say a big thank you to everybody here, because without you all here, obviously, uh, the night wouldn't have been as successful as it was. Um, yeah. <laughs> uh, so, a uh, big thank you to our quiz masters for, for doing it. But first of So the hard work that um, Eddie and his committee put in to actually put in this evening on. Um, and uh, obviously with all your support, you know, there's a lot of good can be done um, regarding the International Committee. They do do a lot of good work, work very hard throughout the year, and um, hopefully you'll continue to support us in the future. And I know Jim would like to, for me to have a little mention, a plug on the uh, 16th of April, he's got a jazz evening. Um, so all of you, if you don't know about it already, there are some posters going around. Um, please uh, get in touch you know, and hope we'll see you there. Thank you once again. Good night. Safe journey home. Come here, you can help and clear up. I'm sure the committee will love that.